Today we're going to be talking about handy tools for creating new content out of existing online content to share and make more available to others. If you've seen our other videos about Twitter, you'll know that many live events and discussions use hashtags to pull anything and everything that is posted about that event together so that people can either tweet their views and experiences live to the outside world or people who can't attend said event can follow along from wherever they are. But those helpful comments, resources, photos and other interesting gems can disappear quite quickly from the internet, making it very difficult to go back and review any live event. However, there is a tool that can help. Storify allows you to create stories from social media content. Just searching by hashtag or theme, you can pull together loads of resources that have been posted online and drag and drop them into a handy scrolling page format. Add comments to add context, and you can effectively document an entire event, talk or conference for your own notes, as well as for anyone who wants to get a real feel for what happened. Storify works really well with images and video and has a really nice archiving function, which means that any tweets that you import into your Storify will get stored on the Storify servers, which is handy in case someone deletes their tweets later on. Also, be sure to Storify an event pretty quickly after it finishes, as once a few days have passed, it is much harder to find more general tweets on a topic through the Storify function, so get them while they're fresh. Check out the sample Storifies that we've linked to in the description below to see how different events can be documented, some for fun, some for really extensive recording, some for tracking success, and some for promoting an event. There are other curation tools out there for pulling together all of those interesting stories and resources that you may well be reading as part of your work. A lot of research is highly specialist, and so having one place to find out really interesting information edited by someone who knows what they're talking about is a really valuable gift. Paperly is a service that allows you to create online newsletter style collections of online content based around certain themes. Just searching for the word science pulls up loads of interesting articles from the popular press and other resources. Once you define the sort of content you want to appear in your newsletter, Paperly will automatically update itself every 24 hours so you can get new content or you can force refresh it yourself. You can share your paperly newsletters with your colleagues and networks or just keep them for personal reference. Scoopit is another curation tool that pulls in information from the web, but it relies on you to do this. Scoopit logos appear on many websites and by clicking one button or copying a URL into your Scoopit account, you can build up a collection of relevant materials and add your comments to each item. When you're happy with your collection, you can then share it as a newsletter with whomever you wish. This tool is especially useful if you want to collect stories around a particular event, topic, or even want to see how the media is talking about that piece of research you just published. You can also search by topic or user to see what other people are scooping in your area of interest. Through using these three tools, you can capture so much of the online content that is out there, but gets lost or missed so easily. So explore, discover and share. Let us know how you get on in the comments and until next time, bye.